So good morning, my name is Davis Eric, and I'm here on behalf of Dr. Yu Yan Wan and his lab to present to you polymer lung surfactants, a technology we developed in our lab to improve the treatment of acute respiratory distress syndrome, which I'll refer to as ARDS throughout this short presentation. If you were to ask a patient suffering from this condition, they would tell you that ARDS is like drowning from within. And essentially, this condition is one where the natural surfactant in the deepest most parts of the lungs has become deactivated. And as a result, the alveoli, which are responsible for oxygenating the blood, collapse. And as a result, oxygenation of the body is impaired, resulting in organ failure for these patients. Now, unfortunately, mortality for this condition remains at about 40%. And this year, nearly a quarter of a million Americans will be diagnosed with ARDS. Unfortunately, there are very few treatment options to this date, and most of them are invasive, leaving most survivors with long-term complications as a result. The way we intend to help these patients is by introducing a nanopolymer surfactant non-invasively into the alveoli of the lungs. This will essentially mimic the behavior of natural surfactant while not being deactivated by ARDS. As a result, the alveoli can re-expand and oxygenation can be restored, ensuring that organ failure is prevented as the body goes through its natural healing process. Now, we have done some early proof of concept tests in an ARDS mouse model, and I summarized the results here with these four bar graphs, and essentially, what we looked at was the lung volume of our mice, where at a healthy, in a healthy lung, 100% of that lung volume is being filled with, with air. However, in the presence of ARDS, that number is reduced to 58%. By comparing our surfactant therapeutic to a commercial surfactant on the market, we found that we could actually recover lung volume to 84%, while the commercial surfactant only achieved 67%. That being said, as we study these two products side by side over time, what we find is that commercial surfactants are incapable of treating ARDS because they too become deactivated by the ARDS deactivation mechanism, whereas our therapeutic remains consistent over the course of treatment. For that reason, our tests support the, our belief that we have the highest efficacy product that will not be deactivated by the ARDS deactivation mechanism. And we know that our product is safe as we've observed no side effects in the mice we tested. We also have a competitive advantage in providing a non-invasive delivery, which is unique to this area uh, of disease. This was something that was highly desired by the physicians we talked to during our early customer discovery. To provide an overview of the legal landscape, this is to date the first of its kind therapeutic for respiratory distress syndrome therapy. And Currently, we have two patents that have been filed, a method of use and a formulation claims patent, which we believe we can acquire with very little uh, difficulty due to very few relevant patents in the currently filed in this space.